Another example of arpeggios uh, used in music is Chopin H.U. Double number eight. Um, he starts at the first full measure. You can see immediately that whether it's a regular arpeggio or slightly different, you still have the issue of how to go comfortably from finger to finger, how to cross comfortably. larger rotation, the single and the double and the double, followed by single, single, double, double, single. Notice as I go down and my form is walking with me, obviously it can't stay where it was and if it does and the fingers go by themselves somewhere it gets dragged over and it's very very uncomfortable, very insecure. But as I bring it over, watch what happens to my torso. It's got to move with me to make room for the moving forearm. And going back up, exactly what you saw in the explanation that, that I gave before. is moving behind my second and my third finger. See a little flick here of the forearm and I'm there, right, left. And as I do it again, it's just like the C major arpeggio or scales in order not to curl the fingers and to be able to play the white key area where's, where they should be playing. I'm coming a little bit out, then going slightly forward to bring the thumb into the keyboard. Little out, out, in, in, out, out, in, out, out, in, in, out, 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 in, out, 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 out. It doesn't move too much, it doesn't move too little. If it's too little, the fingers will still curl. If it moves too much, you falling off the piano and any larger than needed movement is going to cause fatigue, even if it's the right movement in the right direction. So the combination of the rotation, the out, and the shaping, when you're getting a little bit higher, coming a little bit lower, a little bit higher, a little bit lower, higher. what's actually acting underneath. And again, as to the fear, would I lose it if it's done correctly, minimized correctly as well, the feeling is the same. If anything, it feels much better because we were meant to play with the minimum amount of motion. This is why it's hard to see it. Going up, same, up. Rotation with in and out, with shaping. how my body is moving. Exactly the same feeling. Same results.